For years, Kourtney Kardashian has allegedly been hiding a dark secret about her youngest son, Rain. Oh no, I guess. Allegedly, Kourtney had an on-again, off-again relationship with Justin Bieber. Uh, does Justin Bieber help with the kids at all? Right around the time that Rain was born, and everyone thinks that he's actually secretly his father, not her ex, Scott. Sources were saying that the two were inseparable and very touchy Philly. It's a pretty crazy accusation, but the truth behind it is actually even crazier. Justin Bieber. <laughs> Back in 2015, Courtney was seen spending a lot of time with Justin. At one point, it was even reported that the two of them seemed to be completely inseparable while having dinner together. And while she wasn't connected to Justin until after her son Rain was born, it's important to remember that Justin was already a close friend to the family. So many of the Kardashian women have been linked to Justin at one point or another. Allegedly, Courtney, Kendall, and Kylie have all had romantic relationships with him at one point or another. The Kardashians first met Justin when he was just 16 years old when he did a photo shoot with Kim Kardashian in the Bahamas. Ever since then, he's been closely connected to them and throughout the years, he's been seen with nearly every member of the Kardashian-Jenner clan. And Kris Jenner's boyfriend, Corey Gamble, who she started dating in 2014, was his tour manager. So it's safe to say that Courtney was spending a lot of time with Justin and had known him for years way before they started dating in 2015. While the whole idea that Justin could possibly be the father of Rain might seem far-fetched at first, it turns out that there is some evidence to back it up. Rain was born in December of 2014, which meant that he could have been conceived around March of that same year. At the time of Rain's conception, Courtney and Scott were going through an extremely rough patch in their relationship. Scott was going off on a bender of partying with other women and being under the influence, and he's always been criticized for his infidelity. And although the story that Courtney and her family pushed was that Courtney was always faithful, that might not have always been the case. Insider sources came forward to talk about what Courtney and Scott Scott's relationship was really like, and according to them, they said that there were several times during the relationship where they would split up and not see each other for weeks after a big argument. And while we all know what Scott was doing, the insider source claimed that Courtney would go out of her way to seek revenge on him. And they said that she would go out and party with close guy friends. While none of this was actually confirmed by the family, we do know that in 2014, Justin was heavily involved with Kylie Jenner. Although he was dating Selena Gomez at the time, it's believed that he he was receiving racy pictures from Kylie, and these texts are essentially what caused their breakup for the second time. It was also around this time that he was first spotted with his now wife, Hailey Bieber, but he made it clear to her that they were just seeing each other casually and didn't want anything serious with her. And of course, his Playboy lifestyle only continued after that and well into 2015 when he was seen countless times with Courtney. While he had gotten back together with Selena in 2014, it's important to remember that he didn't get back with until August of that year, which meant that he could have been single around the time that Rain was conceived. And if the insider source was telling the truth, Courtney could have easily spent time with him while she and Scott were at their worst. Even though nothing about this is confirmed, the possibility is definitely there. But in all this, it's also important to think about how Scott reacted to Courtney being pregnant in the first place. In one episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, it shows the exact moment where Courtney tells Scott that she's pregnant, and he was really upset by the news and even said that she keeps suckering him in with kids and that she was being incredibly sneaky about the whole thing since she didn't tell him about it right away. The whole thing was a pretty strange response and apparently once he found out, he never came home that night from being so upset. Despite the negative reaction, the two of them were able to work it out for a little bit longer and Scott actually was present for Rain's birth. However, that didn't last long and when Rain was just six months old, Scott and Courtney ended their relationship for good. But it wasn't until 2017 when a source came forward claiming that Scott was getting more suspicious about the possible paternity of Rain. According to the source, Scott was allegedly upset at the fact that Rain didn't look like their other children, Mason and Penelope. Apparently, Rain had much lighter features than the other children, which made it even more confusing since both he and Courtney have dark hair and eyes. And the older that Rain got, the more the rest of the world got just as suspicious, because people started noticing that Rain looked and acted exactly like Justin Bieber did as a child, and allegedly Scott 
not ask Courtney for a paternity test, which she supposedly denied. But what makes the situation more confusing is that Scott had apparently asked for a paternity test for their first son Mason back in 2013, which came as a response to several rumors going around that Courtney had been spending time with a male model. While the reports of the 2013 paternity test are unconfirmed for the family, it would be strange that she would be willing to have a paternity test for one child and not the other. Of course, without the official test, we'll never know who the father truly is, but that hasn't stopped people from pointing out the strange coincidence in the entire pregnancy. The pregnancy was never planned, but from the very beginning, it's clear that Courtney was okay with going through with it, no matter who the parent was. Now that Rain is around seven years old, he's starting to have even more recognizable features, and one thing that stands out the most is the fact that his hair is extremely light compared to his parents and his siblings. And because of the theory about Justin possibly being the father, people have even compared Justin's baby pictures to those of Rain, and the two of them do share a shockingly similar resemblance, all the way from their hair to their smile, and even the way their eyes and eyebrows look are all very similar. But don't get me wrong, there's actually a pretty interesting aspect to this entire story. Scott and Justin look extremely similar as children, and they both have extremely similar personalities. They're both known for being a little chaotic and wild, which is exactly like Rain. So it's just as possible that Scott actually is Rain's father, and maybe he just favors Scott's family more than Courtney's. To this day though, it's unclear whether or not Justin actually knows about the possible paternity of Rain, or if he's even heard about the theory at all. Now he's happily married to his wife Haley, and Courtney is also married to her husband Travis Barker. It was even announced recently that she's pregnant once again, this time with Travis's baby, so chances are that we'll never know the truth behind Rain's real father. But now that Courtney and Scott are no longer together, it doesn't seem like it matters all that much anymore, and even if Courtney knew who it was, the chances of her coming forward with that information are pretty slim, especially when you consider just how happy she is with Travis and how focused she is on their relationship. So what are your thoughts on all this? Do you think it's possible that Justin is the real father of Courtney's son? Do you think that Rain's different features are just a coincidence, or do you think that it proves he must have been fathered by someone else? I would love to hear what you think about this one, so let me know in the comments below.